What's good, YouTube? Hey, I'm back at it again with another reaction video, man. Today I'm rocking a sweater. If you remember that video for Chores Park, this that polo sweater, you feel me? I just like to change up the tops because that's, that's what y'all really can see. So I, I had to change it up. I don't think I'm wearing the same clothes. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe to the channel. Please. You did it yet? I know you probably did it. You're a real homie. Appreciate you. But top 10 dark celebrity. That's hiding secrets from the world, bro. Now, if Epstein on this, that's going to be crazy. I haven't watched this video yet. I'm going to watch it together. But a lot of y'all might know that Epstein, you know, Steve Hawking, he went there, midgets, doing bad, all type, whatever happened on Epstein's days. Epstein, you hear me? But like I said, top 10 dark celebrities that's hiding secrets from the world. Let me get straight to it, bro. Let's get it. Celebrities are people too, which means that they're hiding just as many secrets as you are. At number 10, Woody Harrelson's dad is an infamous hitman. Did you know that Woody Harrelson, the actor we all know and love, has a dad who's into some seriously scary stuff? Yeah, it's true. His dad, Charles Harrelson, was no ordinary guy. As a matter of fact, he was known as one of the most infamous hitmen of the 20th century. So Woody, the awesome actor from Zombieland and True Detective, has a dad named Charles Harrelson. So get this, Charles Harrelson made history as the first guy to assassinate a federal judge. I mean, who does that? That's some serious headline grabbing, jaw dropping kind of stuff. But wait, there's more. He once got into an argument over carpets. Yeah, carpets, and things got out of hand. Over a measly $1,500, he took someone's life. It's insane to think that somebody we see on the screen and admire has, has this whole hidden chapter in his family's past. You know, sometimes reality is even crazier than fiction. Imagine being in Woody's shoes, knowing that your dad had this whole dark and scary side. It's the kind of thing that gives you the chills. At number nine, Sofia Vergara's family history of addiction and murder. You've probably seen Sofia Vergara on TV or in movies, this cheerful, bubbly personality. Well, her life's been a roller coaster ride with some really tough loops. See, her see older her brother was caught up in this horrible kidnapping back in 89. It was a nightmare, a tragic situation that ended with him losing his life. It was devastating to her and her family, but the only family tragedy that she had to go through. Her younger brother, Julio, had his own struggles. He battled with substance addiction, a real fight. Sadly, it got so bad that he ended up getting deported back to Colombia in 2011. Some super heavy stuff to handle, especially when you're in the public eye like Sofia. She's out there making people laugh, all the while dealing with these heartbreaking family issues. Behind those smiles and red carpet appearances, there can be some deep pain and struggles. Just goes mm. to show you never really know what someone might be going through behind closed doors. If you're enjoying this video so far, please support the Make channel sure by pressing like, subscribing to Most Amazing, most and amazing ring that notification bell. At next up at number eight is Charlize Theron, who witnessed her mother off her father. In 1991, at just 15 years old, the would-be actress watched her mother lethally shoot her father. You see, he was super drunk, making threats to harm Charlize and her mom. Things got scary when he tried to break through the bedroom door. She and her mother held the door shut to prevent his entry, prompting her drunken father to step back and fire three rounds through the door, but luckily, neither were hit. It was a terrifying experience. She explained that her dad's drinking caused a lot of problems and that she can only remember him in this state. Her mom acted to protect them, but it ended quite tragically for her dad. The police decided it was self-defense, so her mother didn't face any charges. Despite this tough time, Charlize went on to become a successful actor, using her experiences to inspire others. At number seven, Rose McGowan was raised by a promiscuous cult. So Rose McGowan, she's been in some cool movies like Charmed and Screamed, but let me tell you something wild about her past that not, that's not often in the spotlight. See, back when Rose was just a kid, her family was part of this group called the Children of God, which is a very infamous cult that we often talk about here on the channel. The group had some pretty messed up beliefs, especially about love. 
they were all about this free love thing, but it wasn't all hearts and flowers, no no, it was more like a cover for some seriously dark stuff, letting all sorts of awful things happen, especially to women. Living in that environment, Rose saw some things no kid should ever see. She witnessed how women were treated horrifically. It's no wonder she decided to leave when she was a teenager. I mean, who wouldn't want to get out of there? But even though she's in the spotlight now- Man, I just hit with a mean ass hat, bro. But, man. You don't never know what somebody's deepest, darkest secrets is, bro. Until it comes out. Y'all don't know my secret. I don't know y'all's secret. Might stay like that forever. Unless y'all secrets or my secrets get leaked. She's in the spotlight now. Rose doesn't talk much about her past. Can't blame her. That's some heavy stuff to deal with. At number six, Mariah Carey sold her body while struggling with bipolar disorder. You might have heard this story swirling oh, around, but Carey. here's the real scoop. See, Mariah oh, Carey has been quite open about her struggles with bipolar disorder, which is a mental health condition affecting mood swings. It takes courage to talk about something like that, and it's great when people raise awareness. But there are also these other stories floating around saying that she got involved in some illegal stuff, like some sources claim that she was arrested for being a woman of the night, and even mentioned being HIV positive. Now these claims don't have solid evidence backing them up. It's totally okay to be concerned about people, especially famous ones, but it's also important to rely on credible information. Gossip spreads fast. Now these stories might just be made up drama. We, we don't actually know. At number five, Richard Pryor was raised in a brothel. You won't believe the roller coaster Richard Pryor rode through life. Essentially, his early years were spent in a house that wasn't just a regular home, it was a place where his mom worked as a lady of the night. That environment wasn't exactly a playground for a kid. When his mom sort of bailed on him, he got raised by his tough as nails grandma, who apparently wasn't all sunshine and rainbows. And his dad, well, let's just say he wasn't exactly father of the year material. But the thing about Richard Pryor was that he didn't let that rocky start define him. Instead, he turned his experiences into comedy gold. He took the pain, the crazy family life, and turned it into jokes that made people crack up. This guy had a knack for making people see the funny side of life even when things were bleak, and that's what made him a legend. At number four, Jackie Chan's parents met in a narcotics bust. Jackie Chan's family history is literally like something out of a spy movie. His dad, Charles Chan, had quite the tale to tell. He wasn't just a regular guy, he was a martial arts expert turned secret agent for the Nationalist Guard in China. Meanwhile, Jackie's mom, Lily, had a tough life. She lost her first husband in a bombing during the war and ended up getting involved in smuggling opium in order to provide for her two kids. Now, This is where things got interesting. Charles had caught Lily red-handed with opium at a port. Now he could have arrested her, but he noticed a blue flower in her hair and felt sympathy for her. See, during that time in China, a, a blue flower in one's hair was a sign of immense loss a mark of a widower grieving for her husband and or children. He felt sympathy for her and let her go, opium and all. Their love story began from that moment. Charles and Lily got married and had Jackie Chan. The beloved action wow. actor star comes from a family with a past that's cooler than a spy romance story. At number three, Rihanna's father's second family. So Rihanna, the super cool singer we all know and love, wakes up one day and gets hit with the jaw-dropping bombshell that her dad, Ronald Fentley, wasn't just battling addiction issues, as he had a whole secret family that Rihanna didn't know squat about. Now Ronald wasn't just struggling with substances. As it turns out, he'd been living a double life, keeping his other family, a set of two daughters and a son, totally hidden from Rihanna. Imagine the shock and confusion she must have felt upon realizing this hidden side of her dad. At number two, Kathy Griffin was taken advantage of by her own brother. You might know her as that comedian who's always got a punchline ready, but her life wasn't all jokes and laughter. In her autobiography, My Life on the D-List, she bravely shared something really tough. So here's the deal, Kathy opened up about her brother, Kenny Griffin. When they were younger, he did some seriously messed up stuff to her. He was inappropriate in a really bad way. I'll let you guys connect the dots there, causing her a lot of pain and trauma. Could you imagine going through something like that with someone you're supposed to trust? Now, that's not the end of the story. Kenny's life took a dark turn as he ended up in prison for hurting his wife later on and sadly passed away while he was there. 
It's a heavy load for Kathy to carry, especially being someone whose job is to bring joy to others. And at number one, Robert Downey Jr.'s horrifying past. Robert Downey Sr., a renowned director of comedies throughout the 60s and 70s played a significant role in shaping Robert Downey Jr.'s early life. As starting as early as 8, Robert Downey start. Jr. was exposed by his own father to the substance scene, if you know what I mean. Unfortunately, usage became a twisted form of bonding for the father and son. Despite this upbringing, RDJ's hard. talent and charm attracted the attention of Sean Penn and Dennis Quaid, who attempted to help by sending him to rehab. However, RDJ escaped just three days later, contributing to his struggle. His escapades took a bizarre turn when, when he was stopped by the police while driving naked down Sunset Boulevard, cooked out of his mind, and tossing imaginary rats out of his car window. Astonishingly, he managed to avoid charges. However, he would eventually be arrested for possession of all kinds of substances and a firearm. Another peculiar incident involved him passing out in a random child's bedroom in his neighbor's house while under the influence. The family chose not to press trespassing charges. RDJ's troubled journey continued when he was arrested wearing a Wonder Woman costume in, in a Palm Springs hotel room caught again with illicit substances. Despite a court-ordered rehab, he managed to escape through a bathroom window only to be apprehended hours later. RDJ endured violence and attacks from fellow inmates during his time in prison, waking up in pools of his own bodily fluids. He faced harsh conditions, scrubbing pizza pants for meagerly wages while questioning his sanity. Even amidst his struggles, RDJ's talent persisted. He once showed up two hours late to a meeting for a film role, barefoot, and carrying a loaded pew pew, yet he still landed the part. However, his substance use continued during his time on the popular series Ally McBeal, resulting in his arrest and subsequent firing from the show. Robert Downey Jr.'s journey has been a testament to the highs and lows of addiction, highlighting That's the crazy, challenges he faced yeah. and his Probably remarkable resilience. Girl, Ultimately, his story serves as a reminder that it's never too late to overcome personal struggles and forge a path to redemption. As always, if there's a dark celebrity secret that you think I've missed in this video, feel free to let me know down in the comments. This has been AJ with Most Amazing, and I'll catch you all in another video. Bro, no, I ain't gonna lie, that, that, that shocked me right there. That Tony Stark and Rihanna, boy, that, that shocked me, boy. Who ever thought Tony Stark was on drugs like that? I know during the Stark series, bro, he used to be like drinking hard and like he used to be playing that role, but his ass would be like, I always kind of thought like his ass kind of where he at, you know what I'm saying? But I thought that just the movie he was just playing, but hey, that's crazy, bro. That's why I say you never know where it goes behind them doors, homie. People's secrets, you never know. But hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. See y'all on the next one, bro. Peace out, homie. Blur.